one of the key problems has been the expansion of the uh, monocultures, uh, particularly the oil palm plantations that are just, you know, uh, taking the land away from uh, communities, particularly the indigenous peoples uh, all over. In the oil palm uh, industry and in the plantation, they use a lot of pesticides. They, the workers are also affected by these uh, highly hazardous pesticides that uh, poison them, uh, their children and their communities. And it's, uh, it's, it's affecting the future generation. The uh, women within these uh, communities are now uh, trying to document the impact of pesticides. But more than that, they also uh, trying to uh, be in the forefront of the struggle to prevent the oil palm industry to come into their lands. So they have been putting up barricades, they have been, you know, uh, taking the, the battle in, in the legal uh, arena. So mapping has been one of the key elements uh, of skills that they want to build so that they can now map their areas to show that this is their land. So in the meantime, the women are organizing themselves. They are doing collective farming. They are they've asked uh, Pan Asia Pacific to you know provide capacity building um, in terms of ecological agriculture, so that they don't they don't want to be exposed to pesticides. They don't want to be their children to be exposed, their communities to be exposed, and therefore they they really want to have the skills to move away from uh, these kinds of uh, industrial agriculture. Mm -hmm.